court system tonight on full blast via social media. At least three police captains, a department inspector, and a city councilman issued blistering criticism over how recent firearms violations cases were handled. Frustration on full display. In a matter of hours, Philadelphia police commanders publicly condemned across Twitter how one Philadelphia magistrate set bail for a defendant shown to have close to a dozen prior firearms violations. A captain from the 12th district in a Saturday night tweet, this is a disgrace. The district attorney's office working with us helping to get high bail and our wishes and arguments were denied. Police shared with Eyewitness News that prosecutors asked that bail be set at $1 million. That was denied, and so was an appeal. Police officials say instead the amount set was 10% of $67,500. This comes as shootings and homicide rates are at historic levels. The tweeting commanders further doubled down, writing, this must be addressed. Philly has 469 homicides and more than 2,000 shootings. But the bail decisions do not reflect our reality. These are repeat violent offenders who continually break the law without meaningful consequences. Councilman Kenyatta Johnson also waded right into the feud, writing, quote, We are sick and tired of being sick and tired of repeat gun offenders. The city is safe for no one, he wrote. Well, we have emailed a spokesman with the Philadelphia court system. We are awaiting a reply. At this time, we are not identifying the magistrate, the subject of those tweets.